Security is important for businesses and schools alike, and keeping your files safe is a simple process with Apple's native encryption tool, FileVault, and the Casper Suite. Leveraging the Casper Suite, you can enforce FileVault settings for each device, ensuring they are encrypted, keep track of your encryption keys, and easily audit and report on the encryption status of your devices. And by using the native OS X framework, you don't have to install any third-party utilities or worry about compatibilities during OS upgrades. There are two types of encryption keys available, the institutional key and the individual key. They each have different advantages, and working with your security team or your IT staff to choose which type is most appropriate for your needs before you start will save you a step when creating the payload to deploy to your endpoints. If you choose to use an institutional key, you can create and upload a certificate to the Jamf software server, or the JSS, and have the Casper suite hold onto it for easy recovery. The individual key is set up for this example. This will create a new key for each encrypted device, and in the next step, you can set it to store the key securely in the JSS, taking the job of saving the key out of your end user's hands and putting it in ITs. You can use either a policy or a configuration profile to deploy the encryption payload to your endpoints. The end result and setup process is very similar. This example will focus on the configuration profile. This is an example of a configuration profile created to enforce FileVault on all enrolled Macs. It is set to be installed automatically at the computer level and scoped to all computers with no limitations or exclusions. But you can scope it to any group, building, site, or department that requires security and omit any group that doesn't. It's completely up to you to decide who gets this profile installed on their machines and when. In the section where it asks you what kind of key you intend to use, there is an option to keep the individually created key stored in the JSS. To do this, you can create the setting at the beginning, saving the step referenced earlier. The configuration setting is used in the File Vault Recovery Key Redirection Payload. Here you can have either the JSS store the key, or you can redirect it to a URL of your choice. Once you have the policy or profile built, scoped, and saved, it will take effect as soon as the computers you have targeted check in to the JSS. The end result is a more secure environment with an easily enforced encryption policy using the tools Apple has built into its native operating system without relying on your users to store their own keys. For more information about this or anything in the Casper suite, please visit jampsoftware.com.